that long of an exchange very patient and of course player who's going to put the ball higher shot selection she's all package well done way to call that in the air Jessica Bagola can keep up the trend that is server winning. Wow. She gauged that so perfectly. A lot of hard work from Jess Pagula to get that done. First, she was dueling with Sinyakova. I got this partner. You've got a hold now, and Don't we've got one. the lead on the Australian Open to collect all four. Critique of almost target practice as Pagula has to duck out of the way. And the chance right here at the last second, she was going with the slice and then decided, oh, no, I can't go to. Late bloomer on the tour because of those injuries. Yeah, February 24th. Exactly. We have a birthday when she turns 30. Oh, close proximity, eye to eye, basically, between Chico and Golf. Wow. Yeah. There was some ducking on this point. <laughs> I mean, Krachikova had to really go low to not get hit by that ball. point here. Oh, brilliance from Barbara Kachikova. The passing shot sneaks past Goff and finds the line. And there's the break for the second set. Match tie break to decide relevance in Cancun. And that is it. Sinyakov has been brilliant at the fourth court. All match long in an hour and 48 minutes, the 2021 WTA Finals champions emerge victorious once again, coming back from a set down. Nothing has been resolved as far as who's going to come out of the number two position in Grupo Mahawal, but the Czechs will feel good about getting their win, and it was a terrific effort so far.